In this quick video, I will show you how to use the truncate and the split by functions in Bubble to extract and manipulate a longer string of text. So I have an input field here uh, with a long string of text and here are just some of the ways that I can extract different bits of data from it. So uh, I have a text field down here and I'm going to uh, say input A's value and then let's say I just want the first 12 characters so I can use the truncate to 12 and then if I hit preview it will show me the first 12 characters okay now what if I wanted to do that from the end well bubble also has a truncated from end which if I refresh now we just get the last 12 characters if I go back to truncated from the start, truncated two, and refresh, we'll see that this isn't so perfect because it's quite brutal to count by characters. So what I wanted to extract the first three words? Well, that's when I can use split by. Split by creates a list type in bubble uh, so uh, if I say split by space and then I say um, items until three and then uh, join with, well, no, let me just show you what this would look like to start with. Um, this will list out the first three words, but by default, Bubble puts a comma between each one. In order to get rid of that comma, I can use the join with space so there we go I now have the first three words and if I wanted the first four words okay I can get the first four words those are just a couple of really handy tricks uh, for reformatting uh, the data that your users, the text data that your users may be putting into your app uh, in order to um, get them in the format that you want. One example, and this isn't going to be perfect, would be uh, first names and last names. Um, I say it's not perfect because some people um, may have like a, a shorter um, yeah, so um, they may have a shorter word in the middle um, like a, a muck for example followed by um, their surname um, but let me show you how this would work really well with first names and last names um, so uh, think of a, a first name um, a last name I'll just put Tony Stark so how would I extract just the first name well I can go with the split by a space and then I can just say first item. Uh, and then if I wanted the last name, I can go for last item. There you go. That's just one example of how uh, these little tricks to uh, knowing how to manipulate string data in Bubble uh, can be really helpful.